Hi guys, Alec Pierce Scuba Tech Tips. Here we go now. <clears throat> you probably gathered from the title I'm going to talk about hangers, and you're quite right. Hangers are very important to scuba diving. I'll tell you why. First of all, hangers, most people think that a hanger is for hanging things up the store. Right. That's one of the first reasons. It's a good place to store your stuff. But more importantly for scuba gear, <clears throat> most scuba hangers are now designed specifically to help you to dry your gear as well. And that's critical. That's critical. You want to dry the wetsuit, you want to dry the BC, you want to dry the regulator, and the biggest problem? Boots and gloves. I don't know what it's like with you guys out there, but I never get my boots and gloves dry. Boots maybe eventually, but the gloves down on the fingertips, they never dry out. So there's two reasons, two good reasons, to look at a specialty hanger. Go to your local dive store and ask for scuba diving hangers. Don't just get a wooden hanger from your mom's closet or a plastic hanger from Walmart or someplace. Look, first of all, before you do that, go to a local dive store and ask about hangers. Now, if they don't have hangers on display in the dive store, number one, change dive stores. Number two, go to a company called Trident. I think it's tridentgear.com. And they have all kinds of hangers or uh, um, uh, um, innovative products great company innovative products now these are manufacturers they are not uh, dive stores but you can go to innovativeproducts.com or uh, tridentgear.com and see every possible every possible accessory for scuba diving you could even think of a lot you can't think of okay and the hangers are in there and they explain what they're for and then if you like what you see you can go to your local dive store and ask them to, uh, to get one in for you any dive store in the world can, can order from Trident or Innovative Products. But I thought I'd take a moment to just show you a couple. This is a scuba diving hanger. Now, if you show this hanger to anybody, you show this to your mom, she's going to say, what the heck is that? Scuba diving hangers designed for scuba diving. I'm going to hold this over here so against my black shirt, you won't be able to see it. It's a weird looking hanger, isn't it? That's because this is especially built for scuba diving gear. And it's particularly built for the equipment I just discussed with you. Exactly. So you probably have a nice hanger for your suit, for your wetsuit. I hope it's wide. It should be nice and wide. If not, you're likely to get a crease in there. And I hope there's wooden or plastic so it doesn't leave rust marks. However, that's your suit. What about the hood, boots, and gloves? Ta-da! Hood, boots, and gloves hanger. That's right. You have two boots, one there. <clears throat> one there. I didn't unzip this. Maybe I should unzip it, huh? One goes on that side eventually. It's actually very simple. One goes on that side. And then <clears throat> your gloves. You have two gloves. One on each side. One there. And one over there. And the nice thing about this is you see it holds the glove open and down. So the, any water in there will actually slowly run down the nylon and drain out. And the air can get in there as well. What about the hood? Well, did you wonder what that fancy hook was for in the bottom? That's for your hood. Just like that. Two boots, two gloves, and your hood. And in no time at all, using this hanger, your stuff will be dry. You hang up anywhere. You'll notice that the boot as well. When there's two boots on there, the boot is like this. So that it runs down. The water runs down. And your hood falls down as well. But if you have one of these specialty hangers, then this gear will dry very, very quickly. Okay, let's look at a couple other ones as well. Because there's more than just one. If you look in those catalogs or your local dive store, you'll find that there's more than one. Let's look at this one next. Because that takes care of your wetsuit accessories. What's this one for? This is kind of weird as well. I got hanger but hooks on it so you wouldn't use this for your jacket for your one-piece suit because these hooks would stick up into the suit well you can use this for a couple of things first of all you can actually put a farmer john if you're using still using uh, a two-piece wetsuit the farmer john will sit on there very very well okay and the farmer john will not sit on a regular hanger a regular sloping hanger wide or not so that you use for your jacket and use this for the farmer john that'll work really really well most wetsuits today are one piece Okay, I think we talked about one-piece suits in one of our videos, of one-piece versus two-piece and, and so on. But most suits today are one-piece, and so you put that on your nice wide hanger and hang it up. So what's this for? Oh, this is for your BC and your regulator. BC sits on there, spread it out, put a bit of air in it so it dries, and then your regulator will sit right in here. Throw a couple of hoses in there, drag them down, and so it's not bent sharply, and the regulator and the BC, your scuba unit, essentially... It's hanging there as well. So you have a, a, a hanger for your suit, a hanger for your accessories, a, hang, a hanger for your Reagan BC. Done. Everything's hanging up nice and neatly in your closet. Dry and safe. What else do they got? Well, here's one here. Now, this is, this, is, this is weird. Take a look at this one for a couple of minutes. Yeah. 
What's all this about? Well, first of all, this can be used just as a very, very good suit, a hanger for your suit, because this is very wide and sloped, so, and plastic, hard plastic, very, very tough plastic. So if you, if you need a good hanger just for your suit, this works really well. Nice and wide and, uh, and, and a nice slope to it, nice bend so your suit won't get any kind of a crease in it. But as well, you can hang lots of things inside here. You can hang your BC actually on here. You can hang your BC on top. You can hang your regulator in the middle. You can hang all types. So this, this is a sort of a multi-purpose hanger. You can put all kinds of things on here. If you're going to, if you have a Farmer John, a two-piece suit, uh, this is kind of neat because you can put your Farmer John. See how these pop up? See that? You can put your Farmer John straps in there and put your jacket on top. So this will actually hold the Farmer John and the jacket and a bunch of other stuff as well. So there's a multi-purpose hanger that holds a whole lot of things. Personally, I'm a little bit in favor of breaking it down a bit. Suit, accessories, and scuba unit. Personally. So, as I say, when you go into your dive store and look at hangers, it's not quite as simple as it first appears. Check them out and see what they're for. And I got one more to show you. This is a kind of an odd one. What the heck is this for, Kevin? Well, this is for you guys that use a dry suit. At least that's what it's designed for. It could be used for a lot of different things, but this is really for a dry suit. Well, how the heck do you hang a dry suit on that? <clears throat> Most dry suits, I suggest that you put a rod through the shoulders, have the zipper open, put a rope up through the neck and hang it up. You've seen my video on that. And maybe you, I think on that video I showed you as well that very, very good homemade dry suit dryer works really well but if you're on a dive trip this comes apart you can actually squeeze this pull it apart you have two little pieces you can take this on a dive trip and this will help you on the dive trip in the boat or in your room your resort room to dry out your dry suit and to store it safely as well so how does it work well it's really very simple dry suits have boots on the bottom of the legs they have boots that's right. So you take one dry suit boot, slide it in there, and the other dry suit boot, slide it in here, and hang it up nice and high. <laughs> All right. It hangs from the boots. And it works quite well, because if there's any moisture in there, it tends to run down towards the zipper, towards the open neck, and your sleeves, your arms are hanging down on each side like so. The boots are up nice and high. The whole thing dries. It's nice and safe. No creases, no bends, no folds. So it's actually pretty slick. Take a look at that one, too. A dry suit hanger, special dry suit hanger. So, hangers for your suit, hangers for your suit accessories, hangers for your scuba unit, hangers for everything you can think of, including a dry suit. There's lots of them. Uh, you might just find it'll solve some of your storage problems and uh, help, help you keep your equipment well organized and held properly with no creases and no folds and no bends. Anyway, a couple of tips there. Go to those catalogs, Trident and Innovative, and you'll see all the t different types of hangers they have. There might just be something in there that'll make your diving a, a, little more, uh, a little more enjoyable, a little easier. If it's easier, it's more enjoyable. Anyway, hope there was something in there for you. Talk to you again real soon. Alec Pierce, Tech Tips.